Hello doll collectors, doll enthusiasts, and creatives. I'm Kim. Welcome to my channel, The Dolls, The Witch, and The Wardrobe. Today I'll be unboxing a Disney haul. I was recently in Orlando and had an opportunity to pick up a few things from the Disney stores. I got a Disney princess, a Disney villain, and a couple of Illy Forever clothing packs. This is Cinderella. What I like about her is she looks very close to the illustrations by Mary Blair, one of my favorite artists. Um, she was a Disney artist, but um, this is based, I believe, on the original um, Disney movie, Cinderella. So her dress looks very similar to what she wears. She also has her hair done in a very traditional style with a little blue headband and that black velvet choker. She has at least five, six points of articulation, though her knees bend, you know, with that wire kind of bendy piece. I love her little translucent glass slippers. And she comes with a brush. And the Disney villain that I picked up is Maleficent. I like this one because she has a really cheeky face. I love how um, she they really captured Maleficent, but the one that is the more modern Maleficent that's not necessarily evil, right? She's very cheeky and can be up to no good, but I liked this one. I think these wings can come off. They could probably be unscrewed and taken off. I guess I'm going to keep them on her. I really like her outfit. I love her shoes. If I had been able to take off these wings and the sort of shoulder setup thing, I would have loved to have dressed her in one of the Illy Forever clothing packs, but um, that's not going to happen. So <laughs> I think she's fine as is. So next I thought I would go through a couple of the fashion packs that I got. I got one for Aurora and one for Mulan and I thought I would try on the Mulan clothes on this little fashionista doll that I ended up trading out bodies. It's not a made to move body but it does have more articulation than the fashionista. So uh, I do not like this dress that she has on, so I wanted to give her something else to wear. So after unboxing, we have a really nice little pleather pink dress with some gold detail running through it. Um, I love this dress. It fits great. It's very well made. Then she has these little socks that are obviously knee socks. I love the color. They're pretty loose and that's fine. Um, they work well to put these big, huge shoes on. These shoes are really cute, kind of anime-ish. So I really like them quite a bit. And she can pretty much stand on her own when she's wearing them. And then getting this little jacket on was something, but it's a cute jacket. I love the detail on it, the little dragon. And um, then she's got her little knit cap with a star on it. And uh, it also comes with a purse, a little gaming magazine, and a coffee iced coffee maybe <laughs> so I thought she came out pretty cute
And finally, to unbox the Aurora Illy Forever Fashion Pack. I love this um, outfit. I had actually seen March Payne unbox it. I thought it was really cute. And uh, when I saw it at Disney, I went ahead and picked it up. I was thinking I could use it on this looks Barbie. I really like her. She's tall. Um, really blonde and blue-eyed which I don't have many of those surprisingly in my doll collection so um, I thought her coloring would go really well with this outfit it has the uh, fish net stockings um, attached to the shorts the shorts fit her pretty well um, and I like that it's a little cropped I also have a cute little pink t-shirt with a dragon on it. I love this jacket, this iridescent jacket. It fits her really well, and I think it just pulls the outfit together, along with the sort of dragon scale iridescent boots. They're a little big, but they fit her quite well, and she's able, again, to stand up in them. The headpiece feels a little tight. Maybe her head's a little bit bigger than what they expected, but uh, it fits her well, so I just went ahead and went with it. And then after staring at them for days, as one is wont to do, I decided to change their clothes. I wanted to put them on different dolls. So I did two other looks dolls. And I think they actually fit their personality <laughs> better. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time. Bye.